We're back here again at Legacy Liquor Store in Olympic Village. I'm here with General Manager Daryl Lamb. We've already talked about what types of wines you should bring to a holiday party, but now we're going to talk about spirits. So my go-to choice would probably be a bottle of Bailey's. Again, another one that I'm just familiar with. So, Daryl, how about you let me know what you think about this one? Well, I think uh, Bailey's would be a safe choice, right? Bailey's is an established brand that's been around for generations. My grandparents drank Bailey's. My parents drank Bailey's. Um, but, you know, the selection is so much more elaborate nowadays, so there are a lot of other products that you can pick that do the same thing. It might be a little bit more exciting, a little more different. How to differentiate yourself. If everyone brings a bottle of Bailey's to the same party, it's not really that exciting. So why don't you try something a little different? Uh, St. Remy is uh, Remy Martin Cognac. They also have St. Remy Brandy, which they made outside of different regions. Cognac is brandy, but Cognac is a very special brandy. Uh, so you know you're going to get a solid product from a name you recognize, right? I, I would love to see an, an Irish whiskey based cream liqueur that uses one of the more famous names like Jameson or Bushmills. And now, as you can see just from our selection, we've got dozens of brands. A lot of fun stuff. Uh, Amarula from Africa. It's actually made with uh, uh, Marula fruit, which is kind of citrus, uh, a lot of fun. Eldorado rum cream and Sangster's rum cream. These are beautiful in pina colada. So you just add a little rum cream to a pina colada and it's called a Jamaican sunrise. Uh, we've got 1921, that's actually a tequila cream. So these are products made with other items. So if you're not a fan of whiskey, but you like cream liqueurs, why don't you try an item made with something different, like brandy, tequila, uh, or rum? Okay, so the other thing that's really, really hot right now in spirits are flavored vodkas. But not the old school kind of, hey, here's apple flavored vodka. Now we're going for wacky flavors like cookies and marshmallows and whipped cream. And uh, the biggest brand, the original brand that really started to bring this stuff in was called Pinnacle, uh, which comes from France. And uh, they really hit the market with the, uh, the whipped cream flavored. It's, it's, it's pretty scary how, how much they taste like uh, whipped cream and these can be used in a, in a fun cocktail um, they've got recipes on their website so if you want to do a really fun drink for your party um, you can do that I've tried marshmallow mixed with scotch whiskey so it was like a toasted marshmallow it wasn't my flavor but some people really enjoyed it uh, but you can see from all the different flavors around here now I've got uh, for example loopy is fruit loop flavored vodka s'mores um, Lots of different root beer, um, bubble gum. It's it's vodka that tastes like gum. Oh, uh, with the explosion of flavored vodkas, uh, we've started to see flavored other items. And uh, one of the hottest new things that I'm I'm interested in are these new spiced whiskeys that are coming out. And uh, from really traditional brands, it's it's a real departure from that uh, for them. But they they've come up with some really good products. So one of my favorite is the uh, Canadian Club uh, Doc 75 spiced whiskey. Uh, great for highballs if you want to just do like a little like whiskey and coke kind of uh, easy drink just adds a little different right flavor to it uh, but it's not such a departure or radical like you know whipped cream flavored vodka so it's you're still getting a brand like Canadian Club with a little bit more interesting uh, another one that I'm a uh, really big fan of is the Gibson's uh, with a hint of maple, um, very subtle. So you get the nice like classic rye flavors, your sweet and sour, what you're looking for in a Canadian whiskey, but then just a little bit extra. So you can sip it on the rocks or add it to a drink or make a cocktail out of it. It's, it's a nice product. So this is something really interesting.